as the year 2021 is ending, we wish you and your family a joyful, healthy, and prosperous new year ahead. Happy 2022! Today's news. These are the stories at this time. The Silking Islands of Kiribati. The nation of Kiribati with about 4,000 years of culture, a current population of around 100,000 people, located in the remotest place of the planet, and apparently far from pressures of modern life. Yet, it's the first to face the challenges of its own existence due to climate change. It is expected by the end of this century that the whole country will disappear under the water, a sad reality and a reminder to take actions against climate change to prevent or minimize other ends in the world to follow the same fate. Next news, Lazarus and Romeo, animal species stop to be dead or extinct, but are back to life. Every year, many animal species go extinct, never to be seen again, except in pictures. Sometimes by arrows, some species are listed as extinct, but later on they are seen alive. These arrows are called Lazarus or Romeo, referring to species that are back to life. Among Lazarus and Romeo animals, we have Bovar's Red Colobus, a red monkey considered extinct, but was seen again in 2015 in Congo. The Hula painted frog is endemic to Lake Hula in Israel and was rediscovered in 2011. Fernandina giant tortoise rediscovered in 2019 in the Fernandina Island in Galapagos. South Island Takahe or Noronis, a beautiful bird frog in the South Island of New Zealand, rediscovered in 1948. Chaguan peccary found in Paraguay, Bolivia, and Argentina, rediscovered in 1970. Glittering star frontlet was first known only from a specimen in a museum. It was rediscovered in 2004 and lives in the highlands of Colombia. Farrell Heart Green Frog, rediscovered in 2003 and damaged to Costa Rica. Good news! Serious conservation efforts need to be done to preserve this species. And for our last news, the 100 most polluted cities are in Asia. According to iCare, a tracker of air quality in 2020, the 100 most polluted cities were all in Asia. 46 of them in India, 42 in China, 6 in Pakistan, 4 in Bangladesh, 1 in Indonesia, and 1 in Thailand. The most polluted city was Hotan, located in the Xinjiang region of China, followed in the top 10 by 9 cities in India, including capital Delhi. According to the World Health Organization, more than 90% of the world's population lives in areas where pollution exceeds normal limits. Fair alarming situation, urgent actions need to be taken to reduce air pollution. That's off the day. Thank you for watching. This is Michael from the Newscast on the latest Houston update.